Hey, what's going on, guys? Let's try this problem right here. This question is asking Astronaut Albert is space traveling from planet Goofy to planet Donald at a speed of 0.6 c relative to the planets which are at rest relative to each other. When he is precisely halfway between the planets, a distance of one light hour from each one, as measured in the planet frame, explosions occur on each planet. The explosions are simultaneous in the frame of the planets. What is the difference in the time of arrival of the flashes from the explosions as observed by Al? Give your answer in whole number of minutes. Now, in order to here they are asking for the difference in the time and you have to know the generic equation that is delta t is equal to L over c minus u minus L over c plus u so this is to calculate the time difference and uh, let's see how we can simplify this equation so we can apply this one better now to here what we can do is we can take the common denominator to take the common denominator we just multiply each of them so if you multiply this you are you're going to get c square minus u square you can see a minus b pattern a minus b a plus b we will get a square minus b square right so that's the same thing and here in the top we are going to have L times C plus U and minus L C minus U right and uh, let's multiply this one so this is going to be L C plus L U minus L C minus L U and in the bottom we have C square minus U square and to write this one in better way we can just divide both of them by C square so that's going to give us 1 minus U square over C square and in the top if you look at this one we can cancel something we have LC and this is going to be negative LC so we can cancel this one and this one is negative negative this is going to be plus so that's going to be uh, that's going to add up with this one and give us 2 LU so this is going to be 2 LU over 1 minus U square over C square but the distance here is measured in the planet's frame right so the distance distance is L naught right here here we have L, L so we in order to write this one in terms of L naught we can use Lorentz length contraction equation and if you remember the equation that is L is equal to L naught square root of 1 minus u square over c square so this is the Lorentz uh, contract, length contraction equation now instead of L we can replace this equation to solve this one right so from this one we can say that delta t is equal to 2 times instead of l i'm plugging this one so this is going to be l naught square root of 1 minus u square over c square and uh, times this is l and we have a u remaining so we have to multiply that u and in the bottom we are going to have 1 minus u square over c square now here we need to know l naught and u in order to solve this problem L naught we know that one light hour one light hour and uh, j is the speed of speed of this one so that's 0 0.60 now let's go ahead and plug the values this is going to be 2 times 1 light hour square root of 1 minus j square is going to be 0 0.6 c square over c square over 1 minus 0 0.6 c square over c square and also here, here we have a u so we have to multiply that one so this is going to be 0 0.6 c and uh, if you simplify and calculate this one you should get 90 minutes and that's going to be our final answer I hope this helps thanks for watching